You was really the catch in. I always say we the men are catch, man. I always say we the catch, man. Yeah, so she really booked you. She did though. She is did, what you though. said. Simone Biles is shutting down the haters. Nearly a week after her husband Jonathan Owens confessed that he was the catch in their relationship and that he didn't know who Simone was before they started dating, the Olympian is telling fans to back off. Simone shares to X, formerly known as Twitter, on December 23rd, are y'all done yet? Along with a cheeky photo. And if that message wasn't clear enough that the 26-year-old is over the online commentary, she also reposts several messages from fans. One reads, Never thought I'd see the day where you get canceled for having confidence. As well as one that says, Clearly most women didn't watch the full podcast. The attacks this guy is facing based upon a 10-second clip about his experience is wild. He literally goes the entire interview honoring and showering his wife Simone with love. You people are pathetic. Shake my head. But like I was saying, man, she she messaged me. This is like a Tuesday. And we 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 were texting back and forth and then we hung out Friday, man. And um we couldn't do much as COVID happened, everything was shut down. So um she came through down um down to Houston. She lived in the suburbs, so she had to drive about forty five minutes to me. Um then the rest is history, man. So So you was really the catch in I always say we and the men are catch, man. I always say we the catch, man. Yeah, so she really booked you. She did though. Is she what you though. said. But you know, like I said, man, it happened when you least expect it. And we hung out, man, it was like we hit it off instantly. You know, we just laughed the whole night. And Simone isn't the only one coming to her husband's defense. One of the Pivot Podcast hosts, former NFL player Ryan Clark, starts the December twenty third episode of the podcast with this message. I hate that we have to start the show this way today, but this is what it is. So no pristine shots, no great camera angles, just me talking about Jonathan Owens and having to defend him for something he doesn't or shouldn't need defending for. But everyone is now twisted and taken that and made it something negative. What people haven't done is watch the entire show. What has happened is people sitting in their homes, whether married or unmarried, are now worried about this man and his relationship. Instead of being happy for two people who are excited to be together, two people who support one another wholeheartedly, we've now decided to pick apart one clip instead of learning the whole story. So the moral of the story is this. If Simone Biles is happy, why aren't you? If Jonathan Owens is happy, why do you care how they start or what jokes they make? This is a couple that has found their own way and they found their way to one another in a very unique fashion. And just because you feel like he should be worshiping the gymnast Simone Biles doesn't mean that you can't respect that he's in love with the woman Simone Biles. Man, that's their relationship. And if they can smile, you should stop frowning. And despite all the backlash, Jonathan seems unfazed, letting fans know that his marriage is still a perfect 10. Taking to his IG December 21st, posting a series of photos from their wedding in Mexico earlier this year, writing, Unbothered, just know we locked in over here. Simone also comments on the post, adding, For life. <laughs>